Okay, guys, today I'm reviewing about the, uh, that's, we're going to review, but we're not going to do the wiring. So today's review is the Commercial Electric Exit Sign Combo. I mean, no, Lithonia Lighting Exit Sign Combo. And this one is from, um, Lithonia Lighting Basics, as you can see. And you see how it works just like this. And I also have an older board for it, the same thing. So, now let's get being, begin with the review. Okay, now today's review is this. So right here, this exit sign can come with the red color. And like this red color, like one of these. But these are like really different. So they so they simply, I don't have like the red one. Like the red one like this. But I only have the green, the green one. But this one can come with red and green. And to simply want to do like, um, to like to install the unit. So, the, so to install the unit. On the wall, so to install the exit sign on the wall, is they have the the back. So this one, this is the back, and you simply want to do to install the unit is once again get your packets of screws. So I think they have so get get so get your packets of screws. I think they have um longer screws or millions of screws. Um, of course they're taller. So once again, get your four screws that they give you. So Make sure to put up four, four of the screws and install them on the board, like this. But let me find the let, let me get the fire alarm keys to open it. I think it's really hard to open. There you go. So now your exit signs open, and as you can see, to way to install the unit, get your four screws here. So that I only have four screws here, and you simply want to do is simply place in this little thing here like you i think you need to tie her like two times to install it i think that's it only and all you have to do is simply install the unit like with your screwdriver the flathead screwdriver and you simply need to install it like um screw it in multiple times and and it's all finished and ready to go. And but I only can use with two screws. So I only can only have two long screws. So place them over here and I'll have another screw down there, which is nice. Or if you don't like to to be if you do not want the exit sign like wall mount, they can like give you the the, the canopy to mount it on the ceiling. Which which I do not have because I lost one. So and you simply Place in the um the exit like the, the exit face plate after your, after it. Then that's all done. Now let's go to the re let's go to the arrow part. Okay, so I can see I have the screwdriver here. You simply want to do so. All you have to do so you need you need the tools. So the tools could be the um the packets of packets of screws and the screwdriver and the exit sign. So you simply want to do is just get your screwdriver here and all you have to do is go to the unit, go to the unit right here and simply um op open the face open the face blade. So get your screwdriver and you get your screwdriver go up to the top where the where the holes are. So you simply want to do is just you need to remove these um you remove the face plate with your screwdriver and it will be looking inside of it. So right here we have the exit sign. So inside we have the exit signs um plate and also the bore for it. So they have so inside of the exit signs, um I think so inside of of this um exit sign I think they have twelve LEDs inside of this. And yeah, and also that before you get into to your install installation, you connected the battery to the circuit board, and you and you see and you see in um that the exit sign that is plugged in, and you have to test when the lights work, or if you didn't like um connect the battery to the circuit board, I think I think the battery will be disconnected and the and you hit the test button and the lights will not come on. And let's get to the um arrow part arrow part. Sorry, we sorry, so it's too late. 
So you simply want to do just put the arrows out. And let me just place it in. Okay, now you have the exit signs arrows out. You simply want to do with them. Um, I will say, let's say that the exits should be on the right. Once again, get your hour piece. Get, get your hour piece. And go to the, go to the, go to the middle where the arrow, where the left arrow is, see? So, Pixie, you need to put it on, put it on like that. And now the, now I think the X is now pointing to the right. Or if you don't, if, or if it's under the door, I think you put them both on. So, you simply want to do, but I can. Let me just put it on to the right, just a second. Okay, now your exit sign now is pointing to the right. And I have no clue, like, where, where, where the hour pieces is. I think I have two of them. And so, yeah. Now we'll be getting inside, now we'll be moving on to the LEDs. So the LED emergency lights, they have two emergency light heads. Of course, this one, the circle one. So this one has the small LED lights. So what you simply want to do is rotate them back and forth, basically, if you need. So if you want this head to look like this, or this way, or you can, like, put it down like that. Or you can, like, put it down. And do like this, and the other one, just like that. So it's 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 just a simple way. And uh, let me put it back to regular. There. Now your sign is now finally back to normal. So I'm gonna show you this this the different things that we're about to do. I think it's gonna have the same thing. So let me get my Lithonia Line Basics Exit Sign Combo, but it's not the profile one. It's just the uh, the ECRG one. Let me just get it. Okay, so now I have like one of these here. So they have they have the So on the so on the so right here we have this red combo unit. This is the this is the different one as this right here. But really simple. But like this is really small. Right here, this one's the this one's the similar thing as this one, but this one's on green and this one's on red. The, it's it's really nice. Uh, I have to put this back. I'll put this one back, not this one. We're, we're gonna review it. So we're not going to doing, doing the wires for it. So I'm gonna tell you the we're gonna do the quote. So this um, let's do a quote. So we have the first quote. How does the exit sign? Um, stays on the power outage. Well, so it's simply what I'm gonna ask you is if you go down to the there. So there's there's a uh, so on the right. I mean on the on the left corner, like on the bottom, you'll see a red light and the test button. So right here, the here's the sign. This one says um AC on AC on's over here, and the button says test. So basically, when you press that test button. The LED will turn off and the emergency lights come on. But it's not on right now, it's off because I have the um the plugger with me, but I, I'm not allowed to do with the wiring today. Because uh, I don't because um tomorrow tomorrow night I'm leaving for vacation. Um like I think I'm posting like um maybe like the Doug don't Dunk and Donuts style probably. So um but it's to install the so over here um, if you have the, the canopy, like the canopy, the Lithonia Lighting Basics, um, canopy, they, I think they have to use it. Uh, I think this one could be on the ceiling, but it cannot do the wall mount. So if it's a combo unit, it cannot do the wall mount. So, yeah. Um, so you said we want to do it to switch it to red, because I don't have the red lens with me. We're just going to look to switch the colors. So you said we want to do, um, so... So let's let's so let's go like do the review. Let, let me show you the difference. So the only difference that we do to install the exit sign, for so first you unbox so first you'll be um unbox you uh, so first um you have to unbox the unit and second step two is you need to um wire your exit sign and all you have to do to unwire the exit sign is get your screwdriver and put your screwdriver on top on the top like where it is and and you're going to take the opening unit open the unit here and you have the red you have the red wires 
I'm gonna have to write a wire though. White wire, so this one's the positive, and the red one is the negative. So this one, so this one's not ground. This one is just positive. It's a positive wire, of course. And you simply need to replace this um, lens after that. Boom. Now it's done. Oh! It, it didn't fall down. Stop falling down. <laughs> so I think, um... I... No. I think... So, as you can see, this one... So this thing... Um, I think at the end of the quarter. So for now, this is quarter three. So, um, for after spring break, should be quarter four. And I've gained my new device um, at the end. So, at the end of the quarter three. But thank you guys for watching. Wait, 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 wait. There's more. There is more. So, sorry, I, I didn't understand the difference. So, this one right here is not for outdoor, it's indoor. And I think, so, to install the unit onto the wall, let's see if we have, like, this kind of John Johnson box that... That can't fit in it. <clears throat> like you have to poke. So you simply want to do. Is try to open up the unit. With your screwdriver. And you open it. And you're going to simply get your force. Get your two screws in it. And if you turn it to the back. You have to put the back box. The Johnson box in it. And, and you simply make a big circle over it. So the hole can fit in it. With your wires through it. So I think. And yeah, I think that's this one. Oh yeah, one more thing I have to ask you. So this is the this is the yellow and white yellow and blue wire. So this one's for the trans um the, this one's for the lights. And the transformer is through there. But there's a little switch right here that can switch to green. So inside of this um we have uh, the, we're gonna do the green exit sign and green LEDs. So this one is the um we have. So we have six green LEDs, and the we, now we have the red LEDs, so this one has um six of them in total. So, like, six plus six, I already told you, equals to twelve. Yeah, so, yeah. And now, I'm, let me put the faceplate in. Okay. There you go. And let me put, oh, oh. <laughs> I think that's, the, I think that's all of that. That's it. Thank you guys for watching.